And the Kanpur Library is one of the most renowned libraries in the country. It was initially established at HBTI in 1960. Later on, it was shifted to its present premises in 1963. Initially, it was called Central Library. However, it was renamed in 2001 after the name of the founder director, Professor P. K. Kelkar. Thus, thus, it is nowadays called P. K. Kelkar Library. As regards its present collection, we have about 2.65 lakhs books, about 2.31 lakhs bound volumes. We are subscribing to about 1950 journals in hard copy. Besides, we are getting about 6,500 e-resources from Indus Consortium. At present, our emphasis is to build up a library on hybrid model, where on one hand we are laying good emphasis to procure huge number of e-resources. At the same time, we are not mitigating our efforts to strengthen the print collection in the library. In celebration module, we have allowed our users to go for self-renewal of the books they borrow, which does not require them to come to the library for renewal of books within the personal period. At present, all of our thesis and dissertations produced by the MTAC and PhD scholars have been housed in it. The present collection is of about 11,504 thesis and dissertations. Besides, we are also maintaining a repository of staff publications at IIT Kanpur. The total number of staff publications housed in this repository are 5,353. The ongoing process is on. The students have been allowed to upload these online thesis without even coming to the library. Among many other divisions, we have a computer-assisted reference service as well, which caters to the information needs of not only the institution, but also of outsiders. We have been designated as the document delivery center by the INDEST headquarters, and through which we are able to cater to the needs of the entire engineering community throughout India. We are very shortly going to have RFID implemented in the library. Besides, we will be installing CCTVs at some of the crucial points in the library. We are investigating complete renovation of our library for this purpose. We are trying to uh, procure some modern storage device systems such as optimizers, which will move on railway tracks and they will be exclusively utilized for the boom volumes of journals. We are trying our level best through the collective efforts of the Senate Library Committee, faculty, staff and the students to make this library a nationally and internationally recognized one. The library will not only have the resources confined to in science, engineering, social sciences and humanities, but will also have all the classics of the audiovisuals and will thus preserve the cultural heritage of our country. We will leave no stone unturned to make this library a public reference library of national importance very soon. Thank you.